hello guys welcome to my channel this is dios gfx if you are new to my channel please click on the subscribe button and click on the notification bell to get notified anytime i release a new video so today we're going to be talking about um how to use and um, blend moods so so many i've seen so many um beginners um, finding it difficult to paint without using blend mode and using blend mode which is found mostly um as an option in the layer in the layers so this is what exactly oh, this is what is um ex what is um called blend moods so some in some softwares they also call they they also some softwares um they are located in some softwares in in areas like this they are they are located in areas like this in some softwares like procreate so in some other softwares they are um located somewhere else so yeah it depend it depends on the software but mostly they are uh, mainly located um, in the layer so it's used for changing or tweaking like the moods of the uh, or giving the the giving the your painting some uh, sort of effects and giving your painting some sort of effects and um yeah, and uh, making it um creeps uh, or looking uh, you can make it creeps uh, make it look red make it you can play around with it making it look dark you can do there are so many effects you can use for um you can use by using your blend mode so it's it is a very very complicated option which um, also requires um, you knowing what you're doing so i won't advise a beginner to as you can see you can it's definitely changing the appearance of your painting so i would advise you to as a beginner to um, definitely have a knowledge of what you're doing first so um, as i've always um, advised you should uh, as a as a beginner you should first know how to paint um with values first which is black and white i've done a tutorial on that already i've done like two tutorials on how to paint um with values um they are in they're in in my they are presently in this channel so you can just go check it out i'll drop a a link at the top right corner um you can just click on the link to um refer to the video to like go to the video um instantly so you can just click on the link to go to the video if you want to watch how to um paint um, using values so yeah i'm going to be also dropping another slower videos on how to paint values the in-depth um tutorial in real time how to paint values and also how to block colors um like um, the value colors how to please your values i'm also going to be dropping that and in, in the nearest future so yeah so you can um if you are new to this channel you can just um do well to subscribe just in case um you are interested in knowing how to block colors and how to use values so yeah let's continue um yeah my advice for beginners is to um just con um like let they should just um concentrate in knowing how to use values other than they should concentrate in knowing how to use values on the other than them um, um, stressing yourself um, to learning how to use colors and blend modes and all of those stuffs so yeah just knowing how to use value will help them become a better artist con cons um, um instead of 
um, using blend modes blend mode sometimes if you don't know how to use it it's it um, destroys your painting a lot it destroys your painting so let's do it let's and uh, take for example you're a beginner and excuse me and uh, let's take for example you're you're a beginner and you're done you're done using you're done using this reference for instance this reference was 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 um, painted using this reference was painted using values let's try I'm trying to like see if I can explain better um, so this pen painting was um, this painting was um, made using values and you just uh, wanted to like convert it and use your blend modes to it's going to be very 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 difficult for you to convert um, this using blend modes and also I would advise you to convert your painting using blend modes considering um, it's it's going to be um, difficult for you to use blend modes to convert so all uh, what I advise um, during conversion of um, uh, um, conversion of um, um, black and white or gray scale painting into color painting is that you make sure you have a separate palette like your color palette that you um, have separated especially for uh, your black skin um, tones your that's for your black skins uh, for your fair skin make sure there's a a color palette you've um, segregated or you've separated especially for that that's um for that uh, use you can just simply and uh, close the you can just simply close the uh, layers using the alpha lock um option on the directly on the layer as you can see there you can easily on and off the layer and you just apply the color as as i've done already you can just simply apply the colors you've um, um you've already selected that is when that's if you have if you have um if you have your palettes already on ground you can just simply select them and, and start replacing them just painting over using your alpha lock it's far far much better than using um it's far far much better than using your um using your um your blending modes your blend modes to I don't know blending mood blend, blend mood sorry I'm trying to like con um um so pardon my my mistakes um so instead of you to be using um the blend modes to like tweak um and tweak and um uh, find out what suits the your black and white what blends with the this thing your painting to give you the a good result instead of doing all those kind of um all this kind of um stuff you can just simply replace your color uh, your co uh, color palette with um your gray skill so that's that's far far much more better than i'm um, going through the stress um using blend modes and also you can still um, pop up your color using the brightest color that is your high that is your highlights and when when doing your highlights you can um, simply uh, use the brightest color it mustn't necessarily be white you can just use your brightest color by this side just to like give it a pop but if you think um, it's still dull it's still not looking bright as you want you can still duplicate the layer when you duplicate the layer it's going to like pop up more than the initial one so yeah it's another um this is another trick for you to use 
um, when you're painting instead of you to use blend modes because blend modes is one of the most sensitive um one of the most sensitive um option but if you think you are as you can see it's so harsh it's too harsh on the painting can you see it's too too harsh on the painting so it's not advisable unless you want to use sparkles if you want to use sparkles for the makeups on the face of the um on the face of the model um the face of your painting when you're done you can use um, this option for sparkles you can just use to like add sparkles and all those stuffs on your painting you can just use it for sparkling for some harsh highlights it depends on what you want actually and there's no rules to this just do what you enjoy doing um so yeah is, there's no rule to actually do or a specific way or rule there's no specific rule or order of doing stuff but i would advise you not to like dive in to using um uh, soft glues or um, blending modes for your painting um as a beginner but when you're done knowing how all those things works because for now if you're going to be using um soft um soft glue for instance for your as your blending mood your blend mood on your painting for instance you're, you're trying to use the airbrush for the highlights and you're applying it on can you see what is actually giving you it's giving you a very harsh highlight and you don't have control of you don't have control of your painting at all so it's going to be very very difficult for you to like uh, get what you actually want on your painting so it's going to give you a very harsh highlight for sure so yeah it depends on you but if you still think it's um it's you prefer if you still think you prefer using a soft glue for your painting then it's fine you can still go ahead to use um soft glues on your painting so yeah thanks guys for watching thus far if you still have questions on how to use um soft glues how to use blend moods um, multiplies you can um, comment down below I'll, I'll help you out so i have also um, tons of tutorials on this channel that can help you out with um how to paint and use and how to use values and the rest so yeah thanks guys for watching if you haven't subscribed yet please do uh, well to subscribe and hit the notification bell to get notified anytime i release a new video so thanks guys for watching see you in my next video bye